Hi guys! In this video, I'm going to show you how to clean your fridge using baking soda. Hello! I'm Trisha. I make cleaning, organizing, and lifestyle videos and sometimes I post vlogs too. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe to my channel, click the red button down below, and also follow me on my Instagram account. It's at lovetrisha12 and on my Facebook account, it's thelovetrisha12. All of their links are in the description box below. And if you're also curious of the gears that I use in filming my videos, I also have links of them in the description box of this video. Now, I've always been passionate about using baking soda in cleaning, mainly because I don't want to spend much on buying cleaning products, especially kung meron naman mga alternative na pwedeng pwede mo lang mahanap sa loob ng bahay nyo. Aside from that, of course, it contributes to a healthier environment. So, I was really happy when I discovered that I can use baking soda in cleaning the refrigerator, and I've been doing this ever since I first started living here in New Zealand. Now, I'm gonna show you in this video Video, how easy it is to use baking soda in cleaning the refrigerator. Hindi siya gaya ng dishwashing liquid na kailangan mo pang irinse ng paulit-ulit para lang mawala yung sabon niya. And makikita niyo yan later on in this video. And also later on in this video, I'm gonna give you extra tips on how you can keep your fridge or your refrigerator odor-free. And of course, how often should you clean your fridge? and the other items in it. So, make sure you'll stick until the end of the video, guys. Ayan, so nandito na tayo, guys, sa fridge namin. So, itong fridge namin is nakasali na siya dito sa bahay. May dalawang door siya. So, itong una is yung freezer compartment. So, of course, alam naman natin lahat yun. And ito naman sa baba is yung refrigerator compartment. So, ang ginagawa ko pag naglilinis ako ng fridge is ginagawa ko siya by section. Hindi yung isahan ko siyang nilininisan. So, halimbawa, dito sa freezer compartment namin, since mga frozen items ang nandito, kailangan natin siyang mabalik agad dito sa freezer as soon as possible. Umpisahan na natin, guys, ang paglilinis ng refrigerator. The first step is to remove everything. Remove all the items inside the fridge, including the removable sections. A collision, a decision, whirling in my heart. I've read a lot of articles suggesting that you should clean your fridge using soap, but I prefer using baking soda instead. So, in order to use the baking soda, you have to make a baking soda paste by combining about 1 to 2 tablespoons of warm water into a half cup of baking soda. Tansyahin nyo na lang guys yung water na ilalagay nyo until makagawa kayo ng paste. The next step is to wipe the interior with a microfiber cloth damped in warm water. This is to melt any frozen food molecules inside the fridge. And then, we're going to rinse the microfiber cloth and dip it in the baking soda paste. And then, we're going to wipe it in the interior of the fridge. I love using baking soda in cleaning our fridge or refrigerator because aside from being a natural ingredient, it's great in neutralizing the bad odors inside the fridge caused by mold, yeast, especially decomposing foods. Just lock myself indoors. I'm righteous. Now we're going to do the same thing with the refrigerator shelves. I'm rinsing them off first with warm water and then I'm going to wipe baking soda on them too. it's time to wipe away the baking soda paste. By the way guys, I make sure that I let the baking soda set in like for a couple of minutes before wiping it off para maabsorb niya ng maayos yung bad smells na kailangan niyang tanggalin. So make sure na wag niyong i-wipe agad and hayaan niyo lang muna siya for a couple of minutes para maging effective yung paggamit niyo ng baking soda. Also, make sure na matanggal nyo yung baking soda sa bawat sulok ng fridge kasi minsan din may naiiwan din ako na baking soda paste kasi hindi ko napupunasan ng maayos. So, pag medyo madami ng paste yung microfiber cloth nyo, i-rinse nyo lang ulit siya sa warm water para mapunasan nyo ulit yung interior ng fridge and completely matanggal nyo yung baking soda paste. 
Same process lang din tayo para sa mga removable sections. Rinse it with warm water para matanggal yung baking soda paste and then I usually wipe it with the same microfiber cloth para mawala yung excess water. Now, carefully put everything back. This is now your opportunity to throw away expired or spoiled foods and reorganize your fridge or refrigerator. Now, I don't organize a refrigerator that much kasi hindi lahat ng nasa loob nito is sa amin lang. So, ang importante lang sa akin is to deep clean the fridge regularly. Now, I'm gonna perform the same process in the refrigerator compartment. Dito naman sa part na to yung medyo mas nakakapagod kasi mas malaki and malawak siya. Mas madami din siyang shelves kaya mas gusto ko talaga siyang linisan in sections. Especially if maliit lang yung workspace nyo gaya namin dito sa bahay, hindi kakasya sa table namin lahat ng items dito sa loob ng fridge. Tinanggal ko tong parang cover ng light dito kasi napansin ko na may mga naipo na dumi na nakasingit. So, make sure na bawat singit ng fridge nyo is malinisan nyo talaga. Nobody's like us When people see us, they know uh, I feel so much for you That I don't know what to do <laughs> Someone was before you and someone let me go It's how mama snow for sure Cause someone was Diba, satisfying sa feeling yung alam mo na malinis na yung fridge nyo Kaya I really make sure to clean it regularly talaga Ito na yung pinaka last step natin guys after cleaning the interior of the fridge, make sure you clean the outside surfaces too. This is the last step in this process because all you have to do is get a new microfiber cloth and your preferred antibacterial spray or multi-purpose spray and use them to wipe the surfaces of your fridge. Salamat at tatapos na natin yung pag-clean natin ng fridge and sana nag-enjoy kayo dito sa video na to. Now, it's time to answer the two questions that I laid out to you earlier in this video. Yung first question natin is, how often should you clean your fridge and the other items in it? So generally, you should clean your fridge every 3 to 4 months but as for me, I do it every month kasi I'd like to keep track of all the food items na spoiled na or yung mga expired items na nasa loob ng fridge na kailangan nang itapon. Kapag halimbawa, may hindi kami nauubos sa pagkain, itatago lang muna namin sa fridge tapos ang nangyayari, nakalimutan pala namin na meron pala kaming tinagong pagkain and for ilang days, nakatago lang siya sa loob ng fridge hanggang sa totally nakalimutan na namin na meron pala kami tinagong pagkain and nabubulok na siya sa loob ng fridge. And yun yung actually main cause kung bakit bumabaho yung loob ng fridge natin. As to the drip tray naman, yung parang tuluan sa likod ng fridge, nililinisan namin yun every 3 to 4 months and usually si Dennis yung nagtatanggal nun kasi kailangan mo pa siyang i-unscrew bago mo siya tanggalin. And ang ginagawa ko is nililinisan ko siya using dishwashing liquid. The next question is, how do you maintain your fridge odor-free? So, meron akong tatlong items sa inyo, guys. Una is, syempre, yung favorite ko. Yun yung baking soda. So, what you're going to do is leave a box of baking soda inside your fridge. Pero since hindi ko masyadong afford na mag-leave ng isang whole box ng baking soda sa loob ng fridge, ang ginagawa ko is, I take like half to one cup of baking soda, nilalagay ko sa isang maliit na bowl, and nilalagay ko lang siya sa pinakalikod na corner ng fridge namin for about a month, and then pinapalikod palitan ko naman siya the next month. And then, ang second item naman, and alam ko na ginagawa to ng karamihan sa atin, is nag-iiwan tayo ng uleng or charcoal sa loob ng fridge natin. So, actually, yung mas effective is mag-iwan ng activated charcoal sa loob ng fridge kasi mas magaling yon na mag-absorb ng bad 
odor sa loob ng fridge natin. Pero kung wala kayong activated charcoal, okay na din yung charcoal lang. Yun din yung ginagawa namin dati sa bahay. Nagiiwan kami ng uling sa loob ng fridge. Same lang din sa baking soda. Iwanan nyo lang siya. And then, palitan nyo lang siya pag feeling nyo bumabaho na naman ulit yung fridge nyo. And then, yung last item is lemon. All you have to do is cut the lemon in half and then ilagay nyo yung other half ng lemon sa loob ng fridge nyo. Mapapansin nyo na kailangan nyo ng palitan yung lemon kapag medyo wrinkly na siya, yung parang halata na na absorb nyo na yung bad smell sa loob ng fridge nyo. And ito pala yung pinakahuli and pinaka-importanteng tip ko sa inyo guys para ma-maintain yun na odor free yung fridge nyo. Regularly, check your fridge for any spoiled items na pwede nyo nang tanggalin. So, I do it weekly kasi yun nga, may nakalimutan kami usually na mga pagkain, especially yung mga leftovers. So, mas maganda na regular natin siyang i-check para hindi natin siya naiiwan ng matagal sa loob ng fridge natin. And also, regularly clean your fridge. As for me, I do it once a month pero kung super busy talaga kayo and hindi nyo kayang linisan siya every month, okay na din yung 3 to 4 months, basta regular nyo lang i-check yung fridge nyo for any spoiled items. So, I hope this video helped you guys today and if you like this video, please give this a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel by clicking the red button down below. Also, turn on the notification bell icon para notified kayo every time I post a new video. And you can also follow me on my Instagram account, it's at lovetrisha12 and Facebook account, it's thelovetrisha12. All of their links are in the description box below. Stay safe kayo guys all and see you on my next video. Bye! Hi! Shoutout na muna tayo guys. Shoutout kay Neka Yu. Sana nabanggit ko ng maayos ang pangalan mo. Um, thank you sis sa pag-share ng video ko and pagtulong sa pag-spread ng channel ko. So currently po, very close to 1,000 subscribers sa tayo. Sana makaabot na tayo to 1,000 subscribers. And thank you din kay Lian Bachelier, friend ng kapatid ko na si Ace. Thank you for helping sa pag-spread ng channel ko din. Thank you so much sa inyo guys. And yun, kung gusto nyo din po na shoutout, comment na po kayo dyan sa baba and I'll give you a shout out on my next video. Spend much on cleaning absolute. Move it. Loob. Palang naman dami. Sariya, sana. Ever since you came around I've never been sober Always in my head Met you at a time when I was so